Living the Good Life by Reverend William Henry Channel. To live content with small means, to seek elegance rather than luxury, and refinement rather than fashion. To be worthy, not respectable, and wealthy, not rich. To study hard, think quietly, talk gently, act frankly. To listen to the stars and the birds, to babes and sages with open heart. To hear all cheerfully, do all bravely, await occasions, hurry never. In a word, to let the spiritual, unbidden, and unconscious grow up through the common to the good life. <laughs> My dear friends, let us ask God for his continued blessings upon Elise and Dominic. Let us pray. Holy Father, creator of the universe, maker of man and woman in your own likeness, source of blessing for married life, we humbly pray to you for this woman today united with her husband in the sacrament of marriage. May your fullest blessing come upon her and her husband so that together they may rejoice in your gift of married love. May they both praise you when they're happy and turn to you in their sorrows. May they be glad that you helped them in their work and know that you're with them in their need. May they pray to you in the community of the church and be your witnesses in the world. May they reach old age in the company of the friends and come at last to the kingdom of heaven. We ask through Christ our Lord. Amen. And now let us pray with confidence to the Father in the words that our Savior gave us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Dominic and Elise. In this glass are the fruits of mankind, and Mother Earth. The years of our lives are like a cup of wine that is poured out for the sake of labor, honor, and love. Many days you'll sit at the same table and eat and drink together. Many are the experiences that you'll share. As with this glass of wine, one of you may find it sweet, the other perhaps dry somehow. Let the drink you share today serve as a reminder that although you may perceive things differently, being right is never more important than being happy. With this space that you give each other, always putting your commitment to love and honor each other first, your lives together will grow deeper, richer, and more satisfying. Like a rare glass of fine wine, you may now drink from this fountain of love. May God the Almighty Father give you his joy and bless you with many years together so that you may enjoy the rewards of a good life. May Almighty God with his word of blessing unite your hearts in the never-ending bond of pure love. And may God bless you all in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I now pronounce that you are husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Dominic, please kiss your bride. Gentlemen, it is my distinct honor to present to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Dominic Zunino. Yeah.